Welcome everybody to the Blue Mountains of Australia. We're here just outside of Sydney to not look at the nature. Instead, an old abandoned roller coaster. We're doing both. <laughs> we're doing both. We're both. So this is Scenic World. Uh, it's right next to like the iconic Three Sisters. We're going to show you guys some of the nature and some of the cool uh, opportunities that you can do here a little bit later. But first, uh, there's an old roller coaster here that never opened. Ever. People did ride it. Yeah. But not like the general public. It was uh, apparently like pretty dangerous. Um, and like they, they had some sandbags, sandbags that flew out. Back. Yeah, it was like a three minute ride, like 2,700 feet of track, uh, kind of going all the way around. It, it's very strange. Looks very janky, you guys. A lot of straight track. This was built by people in house. It was not done by like a mainstream manufacturer. No, you can see a little bit shows. right there. It is literally like you can see it from the parking lot right when you really enter. Like part of, well, it was part of the entrance here. The track kind of like ends right over there, but it goes all the way down. So we're gonna explore it and see what we can find. how rusted and disgusting this thing looks. Like, jeez. So Scenic World is like all of this over here. Like there's a whole bunch of it. And it looks like the coaster literally would have wrapped all the way around it, like a border almost. I don't know, maybe it would have been fun. I don't know, what do you think? You think this would have been a fun ride? No. <laughs> okay. It looks stupid. <laughs> we got a nice little like twisty kind of thing right here. I don't know, maybe that would have been good if you didn't like ram into a tree. You can literally see a gap in the track right there for where they put this like post going through it. <laughs> yeah, there's no way this thing could ever cycle. So this part is the rocking part of Orphan Rocker. <laughs> the banking is very questionable, that's for sure. There's no way this was safe, right? Like, there's just no way. So from here it just starts gradually descending downwards. Then here's probably our biggest drop that we've seen thus far, right over here. Upon further investigation, we have determined there either isn't anything here, or we just can't see it, because it's completely covered. It looks like there's like a very small section of track that's just like Is that what that itself. is back there? All right, what are we looking at here? This is the original cabin used from the Katoomba Scenic Skyway. It was built in 1958. Whoa. And uh, it carried over 7 million passengers, and then they removed it from service in 2004. Jeez. Do you know all that off the top of your head? Yes, I was not reading a sign or anything. <laughs> so this right here is the main like parking garage of Scenic World. Look, you just look over. There's where we just were. There's no acknowledgement of it anywhere. Yeah. Well, and you gotta imagine that a lot of the people that visit this place probably don't even realize what this was. So it looks like we were right, and they did remove this section, because you can see just a couple very small pieces of track that appears that's all that's left from this area. Like, you can see, like, the base of the rail, and then just, like, that little section, and then there's that little section. So I think that's about all that we're able to really see of this attraction. I mean, I, it looks like they've taken out some sections, because... Which, I mean, <clears> they should if they're not going to use it anymore, and it's yeah. kind of an eyesore. Yeah, it really is. So, um, like, that's why we saw some of the sections of track that were just kind of sitting there. Uh, there was, like, a one part where it was, like, it's a pretty, like, famous shot where it's, like, gets real low to the ground, like, banks to the side and then twists you over, and nowhere to be seen. So, looks I like it's... it's gone. Looks like it's long gone, yeah. But the fact that they have this much of it still here, like yeah. decades later, is actually crazy. Hey, maybe they're building a new one. Yeah. <laughs> Are you guys building a roller coaster? <laughs> Darn. Well, there you go, guys. Confirmed. All right. So now that we've checked out the roller coaster, we're going to show you a little bit of some of the stuff that you can do here at Scenic World because technically they are rides. So the track ends right over there, and this is one of the lifts that you can take down into the national park. And just to quickly show you the view, like it's like absolutely amazing. But we're oh, like, <laughs> we're like now. yeah, we're like checking out the view, and we're like, oh look, there it is. There's there's more of it right there. 
There's no way it was actually like that though. Like that's I don't know. Is that there's like no space between them? Yeah, the I feel like that is not part of the land. That's like they just picked up the track and just like dumped it. Yeah, dumped it there. Here's a look at some of the different trails, some areas that you can see and what do we have here? Orphan Rock Lookout. All right, so ride number one is the Scenic Skyway. Look at this. Oh, that's beautiful. There's that famous view that everyone talks about. That's stunning. The center of this is a glass bottom. Look at that. That's yeah, a big drop off right there. Here's the station for the scenic lift. This is so cool. Yeah, here's like some old pictures of what they used to do. So, 1933. Then this one was called the Mountain Devil. Mountain Devil 2. Look, there's been so many variations of it. Wow. Yeah, here we go. The world's steepest railway. How steep do you want to ride it? You can adjust your angle that you go down. So the station for the railway is directly over some of the track. Oh, what? Look at this. It's literally like right below us. And they have the original scenic railway car right here at the loading area. Look at this. It's all wooden. That is like all kinds of janky. Look at the incline of the seats. Alright, so here we go. These seats are so funny. What the heck? We're like leaning so far back. Because when we go down the mountain, we're going to be sitting upright. It's an incredibly cool experience. Yeah, I want to ride like in the very, very front. I feel like it'd be really that, scary. That'd be very cool. Yeah. I, I can safely say I don't think I've quite done anything like that before. No, no. That was sick. Like it, it was just as thrilling as any roller coaster you'd ride because yeah. it's completely different. There's a mode of transportation. There's no restraint or anything. Like well, and the angle of descent like on a roller coaster wouldn't be very good because you go so fast. But since you're going slow. You like hang there so yeah. much that it's like a totally different thrill, I guess. Yeah, that was awesome. It's really fun. <laughs> I really like that. <laughs> so here you go. Here's the info that you need. So, world's steepest railway at a 52 degree angle. The next steepest one is in Switzerland at a 47 degree angle. Angel's Flight in the U.S. I don't even know what that is. And Duquesne is also in. The US. Hmm. Yeah, I've never even heard of those. And this is our final of the three different transportation systems that we'll be taking here at Scenic World because... It still looks very steep! I know, we took the Scenic Railway to get down, so now we're going to take this gondola all the way back up the mountain. So there you go, a little look at some of the different things that you can do here at Scenic World. Uh, as you can imagine, it was very scenic. It, it I, was very scenic. I thoroughly enjoyed everything. Exactly yeah. named. Blue Mountains National Park, probably like two hours outside of Sydney. Um, definitely worth it, and you can see what's left of the old Orphan Rocker roller coaster. Yeah, yeah, and you can ride that like really, really steep railway, which yep. feels cooler than a lot of roller coasters I've Oh yeah. That... I'd prefer that over some that I've done mm -hmm. for sure. World's steepest, uh, that is a crazy sensation. Uh, Very cool. I, I highly recommend it. I think it's that like was forward my forward hang time. Yeah, I think that was my favorite of the three. Um, but yeah. the views overall of everything are just really good. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this one and make sure to stay tuned for more here at Coaster Studios and we'll see you next time.